Okay, hi guys, Akumalo Crypto here. Uh, picking up from where we left yesterday, I, I do need to apologize because I presented uh, a wrong concept here. Uh, I presented that the, that the Z wave here would go down as a motive 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Yes, and it's not correct, okay? Um, unfortunately, sometimes we we get confused indeed, and uh, that's what that's what happens, right? We I confuse the why the double combo when which when we have a a why we finish like a, 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 a one two three four five motive. I, I confuse the and and then when we have a Z, we finish with a zigzag or. We finish with a triangle, which I, which, which is which is um which is what I'm gonna talk about now. Well, um, what is pretty clear? This is my one my daily chart, is that we are doing this movement here, right? Again, 240 days, 243 days, uh, something. Let today is the 17th, so we have yes. 244 days correcting okay and uh, this is this is my count okay we have this sharp correction for our W yes our X failed impulse then we have this a B C really flat really flat correction here for our Y then an X okay then we have a zigzag to finish DZ okay wave b is yet to be put okay it's not yet in okay so we need to to see here using our fib retracement tool from the top of this wait a sec that let me just yes our fib retrace retracement tool here from the top to the bottom here this is where i expect b to to, to be well here is where i expect bitcoin to go as high as 7200 okay and then we would have a, a, a the last one to the last motive impulse wave down or perhaps a leading diagonal no oh, oh i'm sorry oh jesus a motive diagonal sorry not a leading diagonal would have a ending diagonal okay um so this is the region that i would expect to be to to land if we go a bit higher and touch this yellow line here, like 7700, perhaps we have this situation here, okay? We will have a triangle. This would imply more time to finish the correction, yeah? Uh, perhaps we open a little bit this line here. We don't know. This line here is, is just acting as a resistance so far, but it, it doesn't need to hold the to hold Bitcoin we might have a, a, a new low here but we might have this triangle as well okay this is possible um, for now I do think that we need to bounce to this region okay uh, at least 7 7k I don't know right this is the 65 618 region so it's gonna be a a strong resistance yeah really strong resistance and then we will have this C if we project okay this is the projection this is our fib extension too if we use from the stop to the bottom a projecting to where I think is gonna be our B here we have right this box where we have the seven seven eight six uh, retracement from this whole structure where would be the wave two we have this 127.20 for our wave c which is the the sweet spot for wave c so this is a this is a nice a nice confluence and we have another confluence as well if we go here get our fib retracement from the top of this x to the bottom of this one here okay okay what I'm doing swinging from this top top point here 
of our x to the bottom to this pivot bottom here our wave y okay that this this is what i'm doing x to y so what we have here another confluence guys minus 33 60 percent exactly almost in this box here where i market the algo target so the algos that sold here at 50 percent here of this structure this is this retracement here is now waiting to buy here at 4k right 44 4400 minus 30 60 percent so we have some confluence here this box here where i which i'm marking here this box here that the low the lowest point would be 3 38 3800 which i think is going to be really difficult to get to this point here to get to 3k but we never know so we have some confluence okay another another data another uh one more piece of information to add to our box to give us uh confidence that to give us a, a hint where we are going right let's 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 retrace another point here let's retrace from this top here to this bottom to see if we see something else right this top here this x to the bottom where we see the this a oh well so we see the minus 618 percent exactly at the 786 you see this confluence here this is beautiful confluence right beautiful confluence I'm sorry, uh, I don't know if you guys can see, minus 618, exactly where we have the 786, okay? Of course, we have those algo targets here, this would be a, a one of one strong algo target to get down because this is not a huge retracement. Yeah, again, let me explain you guys what I'm doing here, what I'm doing here is uh, whoever said, whoever sold here at the 50%, is waiting to buy at those levels here minus 33 60 percent minus 38 20 minus 618 okay so it's nice isn't it so i am expecting bitcoin to go up at least for the moment i have a bullish and this is what we see here a lot of indecision but we start to see some green candles here right so are we going up to put in this B wave which I which is what I'm proposing we need to wait right so um, this is my weekly chart as I have been saying guys this is our trend line strong trend line this blue trend line here has hold all the attempts to go down every time that it tried to we, we see a lot of touches right touch 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 every try every, every time that it tried we had some kind of reaction yes reaction reaction so this is another piece of information to give us confidence that we are going up okay that we are gonna perhaps touch this this is the 55 EMA this is red here okay this is gonna be a strong resistance this is at the level of uh, 7300 okay perhaps we're gonna touch it and then we're gonna go down perhaps break this blue line here and touch the 100 ema here okay something like this this is completely hypothetical this is this is i am forecasting here guys okay talking about uh like uh, uh, probabilities okay ta technical analysis is not about certainties it's about probabilities okay and we use our tools to help us figure out what's going on that's it uh this is my our chart bitcoin this is okay this is exactly what i propose for the daily chart but this is in the, this is the one hour chart so i'm sorry for the mess so this is our a wave we are now going sideways to finish this b wave within this b wave of a higher degree this b wave here this b wave here is this b wave here okay guys it's the same thing is this b wave here okay are we going 
to see this 7 to 7 C is the same confluence. We have the 50% here, 7, 7100, okay? Which I think we are gonna get at least to this 50% here, which is the 50% of this whole movement here. The best, the desired spot for a B wave, okay? 50% here, okay? Uh, and then we have this A, B, C, okay? Let's see, let, let, let's see the... We haven't finished yet the B wave, okay? We haven't. Although we have indeed put this this first A wave here has retraced 50%, okay? If we measure it using the fib retracement, we are gonna see that this is the top to the... To this is the bottom to the top. We have retraced 50%, okay? We have, we touched it twice. But as we are going sideways now, we are, we B wave, this, in this case, is gonna be a flat, I think. It's gonna be, perhaps, it's gonna take like one more day to, to go down to the C, or perhaps we see some kind of triangle, yeah, information. A, B, C, A, B, C. I see some kind of triangle here, perhaps a, con a contraction. So we won't see something, no, okay, uh, pardon me, let, 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 let me take this out and show you guys what I'm, what I'm proposing. Something like this. This would be our A, a B, a C, a D, and an E. Okay? This is, a, again, hypothetical, okay? We are going to be uh, uh, lingering around this region and then we will form... This is not a contraction, this would be more like a barrier, okay? Uh, a barrier is this kind of structure here. Let me show you guys. Again, going by the book. Sorry that I need to do this every time. I should be more efficient. Don't you guys like to, to be reading like fast? And <laughs> this is a barrier, okay? Something like this. Or perhaps something like this, contracting. But I, I yeah. a barrier would be... Uh, a barrier would be the, the case here, right? We would have a line here forming and then we would have this this line here perhaps at the bottom. Again, hypothetical, okay guys, hypothetical. If we have this line here and we have a line going down here, okay, you see? This is the barrier, okay? This is structure here, okay? Again, hypothetical. We don't know. And then we will have this C, the, the, the C here, again, touching this, this line here, not really putting a new low, and then D, E, and then we would go up. Okay, it's, a, it's, it's possible. Okay, it's another possibility that we are gonna go sideways. Yeah, we are going sideways, by the way, yeah? This is, this A, B, C here, that I'm proposing this is it's not gonna break this resistance now at least this if it breaks now it, it's, it would be uh, different right um, I would be missing some information we need to recount this I would need to reconsider this structure here if this is a B going up here and we have this B here and we are gonna perhaps touch the support Okay, with this C wave here, we need to see some kind of reaction or some kind of uh, triangle formation. Okay, that's what we need to see. If this is a B and then we are going to have this new high here. Okay, this new local high. Okay, 50% of this whole structure here. Remember, this is a correction, a correction of this A wave here. Okay, that I'm proposing to you guys. Um, so that that's pretty much what we have, right? The, not not that much has happened, but I do need to apologize for my mistake yesterday, that I was counting these as a one, two, three, four, five. This is completely wrong. Okay, what we have is a zigzag, and again here we have another algo target here that is from the structure. Okay, I'm marking the same thing that I marked here at the. Uh, the overall picture okay 
Uh, I won't talk about altcoins, but if you follow me on Twitter, perhaps I'm gonna start posting something about altcoins there. Uh, if you haven't joined us on our uh, on our Discord group, the Crypto Trading Institute, Educational Institute, it's a really fun group. We are having a lot of information. We have a lot of information there. Uh, we are there together to learn. Okay, so it would be a really nice thing to have you there. So the the invite is in the description. So just click there and join us. And if you haven't followed me on Twitter yet, please consider doing so. And have a beautiful weekend. And thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Cheers. Bye-bye.